strap on your AR goggles. We're going to space. NASA plans to send a couple of Microsoft HoloLens headsets up to the International Space Station. I'm sure you've heard about the HoloLens augmented reality headset, but just in case, here's a quick overview. It's a display you wear on your head. The lenses are transparent so you can view the actual world around you, but the HoloLens can overlay digital imagery on the lenses, augmenting your experience. So NASA's going to send a couple of them up to the ISS. Again, the first time they tried to do this, the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket carrying the headsets, plus about 5,000 pounds of other stuff, had a critical failure and everything fell back to Earth, burning up upon re-entry. Fortunately, the spacecraft was unmanned, and so while we lost a lot of stuff, no one was hurt. The next attempt to get HoloLens into space will take place in December 2015. Right now, Microsoft is preparing the HoloLens headsets so they'll be certified for use aboard the space station. But what the heck will the astronauts use them for? On Earth, the most popular demos of the HoloLens have largely focused on gaming, but that doesn't mean astronauts will be playing Minecraft in space. Instead, they'll leverage the HoloLens to perform practical tasks, such as performing repairs. The HoloLens has a camera mounted on it, meaning people back on Earth will be able to view situations from an ISS astronaut's perspective perspective, and experts on the ground can make real-time annotations that will pop up in the astronaut's field of view back at the ISS. So, imagine you're floating in the ISS looking at an incomprehensibly complex panel of switches, buttons, and wires. Someone on Earth is talking you through a sensitive repair, and as you look at the panel, you can see specific parts highlighted or circled so that you can follow along step by step seems pretty handy. And if that isn't cool enough, this technology will let us earthbound mortals do similar things. Sure, we might be fixing a sink rather than repairing a space station, but it's still pretty cool. Now that's all for now, right now. But we'll have more now, later. In the meantime, hit like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to keep up to date with all the coolest news going on right, well you know.